Welcome back to Inside the PGA Tour. We're now here at my house here in Birmingham, Alabama, and I just wouldn't be remiss without showing you a few of my, uh, my little toys here. I've got a 05 Jetta GLI. I got this my first year out on the PGA Tour. It's kind of a reward for getting, getting my tour card, and uh, I absolutely love driving this little race car around. This is a brand new 2014 BMW M5. Man, this, this thing's a beast. This is a great luxury car, and I, I've always wanted one. It's been one of my dreams to own a car like this. This is a fun, fun toy. I think I always had this dream of this grand lifestyle and owning a bunch of cars and what that might be like, but I never really truly believed that it would actually happen. Last but not least, the big 1977 F-250 Crew Cab. I bought this as a trophy, basically, after I won the Honda Classic. It's just a fun truck, the sound's awesome. It's got a 351 Windsor motor in it. Since I live in Alabama, you gotta have a truck. Why not go big time? It's obviously a lot more than I need, but at the same time, it's a blessing to have, and because it's a blessing, I wanna share it with everybody. Our host got to share another passion recently at the Honda Classic Media Day. As the only current Eagle Scout on the PGA Tour, Thompson can impart some valuable knowledge to those standing in the shoes he once hiked in himself. Our scout here today. If you hey, want. Hi. Casey Wallen. Casey, good to meet you. Good to meet you. Sir. Yeah, we have a scout shirt for you. If you oh, really? put that on yeah. and take a picture That's with that, sure. we can do that. I haven't worn one in a while. <laughs> oh yeah, I got the golf merit badge. Okay. It was probably the easiest merit badge I ever got. <laughs> I know I don't look as good as these two guys. When I was in Scouts, only 2% of all Boy Scouts became Eagle Scouts. I mean, think about how many millions of kids grow up being Boy Scouts, and only 2% of all of them become Eagle. And to be one of that 2%, it's really special. Where did you guys get your Eagle? Uh, January 27th. Oh, nice. Just recently. Yeah. Oh, congrats. Thank you. Were you nervous in the board meeting? Yeah. <laughs> I was too. Yeah. <laughs> It's just an honor to be an Eagle Scout. And I truly believe that if you get to that point in your scouting, the sky's the limit. You can do anything with that. It's something that nobody can ever take from you the rest of your life. So I take this off much. or? You can show us if you want. It's yours if you want. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, sweet. <laughs> I'll keep it. Sometimes they mis get misplaced over here. My, my mom still has mine. I, I, I just know it's not going to fit anymore. <laughs> I'm truly indebted to the Boy Scouts because I wouldn't be the person I am without them. Well, best of luck to you. Thank you. Yeah, keep up the good work, all right? And like the elite faction of Eagle Brethren, he has joined another exclusive group, PGA Tour Champions. It's still hard to believe that I'm, uh, that I'm up there. Not until this year that I really started to look back and evaluate kind of what's my motivation for being out here, because I love the game. I want to go out and have fun. I want to enjoy what I do. And by enjoying what I do, I can be an inspiration to other young golfers. <laughs> Thompson will once again battle the game's best at the Honda Classic in hopes of joining Jack Nicklaus as only the second player in tournament history to successfully defend his title and stymie the bear trap. I don't have any expectations. I'm just excited about what might happen because uh, I have a feeling it's going to be really good. Maybe I should stand on a phone book. <laughs> That's how you do it, boys. Hey, thanks for hanging out with me on Inside the PGA Tour. It's been great having you here in Birmingham, Alabama. I think it's time we take this big old truck for a ride.